Yes, peeps, the great king crab. Look at it. It's not dead. Freshly catch. Turn him over. They make them see more him big. This one just catch, guys. Freshly catch. King crab. If the partner they ever catch you, oh my god, man. Mm -mm. So now, you're dead, don't. Hey guys, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? I am on the outside. And I have two massive Caribbean king crab here. Yeah, I'm about to do some rundown with these crab right here, guys. Yeah. So these are the things them that we are going to use and thing, you know. I'm going to use a grace coconut milk powder. Yeah. And they pat the right over here. So guys. Good water. Just waiting on the fire to light. You know we have some fresh springtime. We have with garlic. Some scallion. Bad boy scotch bonnet pepper. Tomato. And we have a piece of ginger. Yeah, and we have our seafood seasoning. That's the only thing we're going to use as seasoning in it. And we have some salt here. Yes, guys. So if you hear any noise, a lot of breeze, a lot of breeze has been blowing. Yeah, you see how the sun is shine bright and pretty. Yeah, man. As you jolly hear any noise, any dog barking, any bird chirping, anything at all you hear, guys. Don't forget that I am on the outside. Outside, outside. Where were they? Outside. Look at the flowers, guys. That's how strong the breeze is. Look at that. Yeah. So our big king crab is about to get scarred off. So I'm seasoning up the water. And guys, with king crab, you don't need a whole heap of season. This crab is already have a little buzz to it. Whereby you don't need a lot of seasoning and all these things. You need a lot of earth seasoning. Yeah, man. Alright, so I'm using some maggi. <coughs> Smell the pepper already. <coughs> some maggi chicken noodle. So I have some garlic, scallion, thyme, pimento, pepper. Yeah. So here we are now. We'll cover this. Because I need the water to be boiling before I put them in. Alright? So I'm putting in some salt, guys. Yeah? So that's some salt I just put in. Mm -hmm. So guys, I'm brushing out my king crab. This may not be the best brush, you know? It's an old toothbrush. But I'm still using it, yeah? As you know, you have to brush it off before you put it in the pot, right? Mm. So basically, I that me I do. You know, you want to brush it off clean. You know? Before you get it in the pot. So finish brushing it guys in the pot. Yeah. Bad boy. Same procedure for this other one. Uh, in the video. So guys, we're on to the next the next king crab. You know, the brushing process. You know you want it to be clean before you put it in the pot. As I said, this may not be the best brush, but yeah. It a angle itself, it a go on, it a go on with itself. So we are about to put this one in the pot as well. So stay with us. Big gianty. And guys, guess what? The color going to change, yeah? All who know King Crab knows that when you ask it, the color change. 
Yeah. All right, we soon fix that properly in the pot. I don't know, so them big, you know, some huge ever thing them, so. And they saw it there. These are some foots that came off. Peeps with our king crab, with our rundown king crab, we are going to have some roast breadfruit. Yeah? So I just set on that on the fire. Breeze a kick. Outside cool, you see, guys. The tree them just a blow so the wind just have the tree all over the place. Nice breeze. So our king crab is finished call. So we're going right over to it now to take it out. So our king crab is finished call. So I'm going to remove it from the pot. I have, I have already drained the water off it. So I'm basically removing it from the pot, guys. You notice it changed color. So you're going to see what I do with that. Yeah. So we're removing everything. So I'm going to go ahead now. Wait, my breadfruit won't turn. I burn my breadfruit, I burn up it won't turn, guys. Guys, me over there, I take out king crab out of pot and left my breadfruit. Now I attend to it. Look at that. Well, that no burn still. What do you think? You know, good man. Yeah, man, that good man. Stick around and stay tuned. Don't leave. You will see what happened. You will see if the bread burn up, yes or no. Because if it even burn up, we still have to eat it the same way, yeah? Stay tuned. Alright guys, so we are dismantling king crab now. Mm. Got that flesh man, whoa! Water is coming from it. You want to drain that away? For those who don't know king crab, this is not like our crab. You see the back part, guys? Nothing much is in it. Basically, not nine night. Come here, talk about nothing much. Not nine night, guys. Yeah? So, we put that over there, so and we deal with that part here. We'll remove. Remove what is to be removed. Yeah, yo. Flaky white flesh, guys. Look at that. Flaky white flesh. Yeah, we're putting that as well. Look at that, guys. Nice flaky white flesh. So I'm just getting this all ready to do my rundown, as I tell you guys. Yeah. I'm basically just getting them in a smaller piece, small bits. So stay with me, guys. If you want to see how I do my rundown, my king crab rundown, don't go anywhere. Guys, in cleaning up your king crab, you need to remove this. 
basically guys the same way how you do our crab out here our jamaican crab yeah it's the same way you remove the only thing you know you see with king crab it don't take long to cook you know so guys you preheat your pot as usual before you're talking your butter in your pot you pass your butter around and melt it put it in my season then i'm gonna put the coconut milk in with our coconut milk i'm gonna cover this and leave this now too bam so guys i'm putting in some pimento scotch bonnet pepper and garlic on top of that i'm using my seafood seasoning I'm dashing a little in this yeah don't need any more than that guys this, this king crab is already spicy and all of that you know you don't need to need you don't need to use a lot of seasoning so guys i'm adding my crab to the pot so guys basically this is my king crab rundown king crab and mud crab is a combination of king crab basically the bodies are the same but the pan the claw is different the claw of the king crab is huge yes guys so i'm gonna play this for you all to see i'm gonna leave this for a couple minutes yeah catch me back stay with me to see the plating of this rundown guys so guys i am peeling my breadfruit you know the best thing about this breadfruit guys guys it, it is turn so you know this is going nice mm -hmm. turn breadfruit so guys this is our rundown big bad king crab Mmm. Mm-hmm. Nice. Mmm. Mmm. Mm -mm. Remember to share the video, guys. Mmm. Flesh, flesh and nice meat. Remember to share the video. Our outside we have a Heineken with that. To top it off. Mm-hmm.